Okay. I'm going to give you a video on the Easton E100P baseball backpack. Uh, this is pretty much like the kids' edition of their backpack for younger kids, you know, probably age 5 to 10 or 11. Um, here's the information. We got it at Dick's, so that's the price. You can get it cheaper if uh, they, uh, Dick's does a price match. So if you go on Amazon and you find it cheaper, they will price match it. Here's the dimensions of the bag. 16 height, 12 width, and 7.5 depth. So what I'm going to show you basically is just how much stuff you can fit in this bag. Um, you know, they make bigger bags if, you know, you know, you got an older kid with, you know, bigger shoe size or a bigger glove, bigger helmet, longer bat. But like I said, this, this is a pretty good backpack. If, you know, you have a kid between five to 11 years old. So first we'll just going to show you the material it's made out of. It's, it's pretty, pretty strong. You know, it's. Got two back straps that you can adjust any way you, you know you want. There's many different colors. There's blue, royal blue, navy. There's a white. And there's an all black. Um, you know, variety of colors, but it's it's very strong. I definitely definitely was surprised. You can actually even use this as a as a book bag for your kid going to school. <laughs> Because I'll tell you, we bought some of those cheap backpacks at Walmart for like 10 bucks. They last for like three months and we got to get new ones. But this one looks very, very durable. Um, we got the Easton zippers here. Everything's, you know, official. You got three zippers on it. This is where your bats go. I'm going to show you how everything works. But this is just a basic description of the outside. You can hang it up like that, you know, when you're at the ball field, hang it up on the fence or whatever. But let's see what we can fit in this puppy. Now you see this spot here, this is good for, you know, you want to put your batting gloves in here, you know, chewing gum. You know, the kids like the big league chew. You stick that in there. Let's see what we can get in here. First, you put the biggest thing. I usually put the helmet in first. The kid needs, obviously, the helmet. Now, some of your sports teams, baseball teams, have their own helmets they provide. They do in our town also, but, you know, with all the lice and nasty critters some of these kids carry, it might be a good idea to get your own. But, all right, so we got the helmet in. Pretty... Pretty sturdy. Then what I do is I put the glove in. So I stick the glove right inside the helmet. Plenty of room. Then we got the cleats. You know, this is optional. You know, some people wear the cleats. I'm just trying to show what you can fit in here and how much room you got. So you put your cleats in there. You still got room. You want to put their Gatorade in here, their water or whatever. You definitely got some room. So, like I said, you can fit everything you want in this bag. So then you zip it up, and this is how you put the bat in. So right now, it's fine. Light. Like I said, very durable. So now, you, you, this uh, bag holds two baseball bats. So, but like I said, the bats that this bag carries, I mean, you're not going to really put like a 32-inch bat in here. This is a... 26 so this fits perfect anywhere from a 25 inch to probably a 30 inch you really won't have any problem with it but this is basically stick that part in there goes right through these two things you just slide it right through into this little pouch that's where the barrel goes and you're ready to go your son or daughter puts the straps on just like a regular book bag and you're ready to rock. And like I said, you can put another bat in here. Actually, I'm gonna show you how that looks uh, with another bat. 
because you know some of these some of your kids have two bats now a game bat and a practice bat but I'll just show you and there you go you got your two bats in there stands up on its own which is great and I recommend it I really do um, D Marini makes another bag I believe Louisville Slugger makes a bag uh, this one's at the higher end, actually, the Easton, than the Louisville Slugger. Uh, it's definitely, if you're looking at the Louisville Slugger bag for your for your child, this is definitely stronger. You'll see when you pick it up, the materials here are stronger. It is a bit more, but go on Amazon. They do a price match. you get it for cheaper if you're interested in this bag. But here you have it. It's the Easton E100P backpack. Any questions, comments? Let me know.